Hey, I'm Alan Brito from Blender 3D Architect, and welcome to this tutorial about importing IKEA models directly to Blender. We'll be using a free add-on. Uh, it's this add-on right here. It's part of the Blender official extensions repository, so you don't have to make any additional downloads. You can get it straight inside Blender. And uh, just a few notes, it's on early stages of development and it's quite new it was released i guess uh, about uh, two weeks ago from the moment from the time i'm making this video so let's take a look on how it works you can see that people are already loving it to get this add-on you have to come into uh, into edit preferences and look here in get extensions and if you just type ikea it will display the add-on i already installed the add-on so uh, the install button won't show up for me but uh, just hit the install button and it will install the add-on for you let me enable it here and as part of the of the set of the settings you can uh, change here your language and uh, the country where you are not sure uh, if there is any code about this i'm using international here it will add a new tab on your sidebar and you can see that it will already display some of my past search let's try here chair press enter and it will display some chair models and if you select any of those and hit the import button it will add the chair model when you are uh, trying this for the first time or in when you are uh, trying to import uh, any of those uh, models here for the first time blender might uh, hang up for uh, for a few seconds because it will have to download the data straight from the ikea website so uh, don't don't worry about that and uh, as a plus for this add-on let me move this here And as some models, uh, it won't uh, find any, it might not find uh, a 3D object, so it will display an error message. Let's try another one. It found this object. Let's move it to the side. Let's try some sofas. Let me go to the top here and search for sofa. Let's try to get this one. No, it doesn't have yet. Yeah, this one has a corresponding model and you can see that it's quite easy. You will see all of your models or the results of your search. And if you select any of these objects, it will go into the IKEA website. It will give you the name of, uh, that, of this particular furniture piece. And at the price, you can even open the IKEA website straight from here. As a plus, some of those models uh, will come with uh, materials. You can see here that we have materials. It's not the cleanest mesh. If you go into wireframe, you'll see that we have lots and lots, lots of triangles. But hey, this is uh, completely free and uh, you can easily uh, add lots and lots of different furniture pieces uh, into uh, any of your projects. And uh, one, uh, one note here about searching for uh, models in IKEA. If you just type sofa, it won't display many options. But if you know the line or the brand, uh, the segment of the furniture uh, that you are trying to find, if you add it here, for instance, let's try Kniza. It will only give this particular uh, furniture piece. There we have it. Just the Kniza dark, Kniza. Just furniture pieces from this lineup. And this is it. This is how to use this incredible and a free add-on to import uh, furniture pieces directly from IKEA. And as always, if you like this tutorial, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so you won't miss any of the future tutorials. And don't forget to check my uh, latest workshop, Precise Modeling with uh, Blender. Links in the description. See you next time. Bye.